This pen dispensary knocked to the ground by an angry town resident who called in Brookhaven officials to lug it away, furious at whoever installed vending machines across the community filled with apparent drug paraphernalia. It's a crack pipe. It's a ceramic glass pipe disguised as a pen dispenser Thank you. that you put two bucks in in quarters. What was amazing is the audacity of the people that did this. Audacity indeed, say homeowners in Coram and Medford, where at least three coin-operator dispensers masquerading as innocent pen machines seemingly appeared overnight in state public rights of way, adjacent to malls and bus stops, now littered with pipe cases and lighters, luring the susceptible. They look like they're on some. They're like kind of crazy, so. Using that vending machine. Yeah, I mean, I think they should, you know, the town should offer some kind of help for them. To see someone come out and try and take advantage of individuals who are out here that we're trying to help, it's upsetting. Town officials said at first parents thought pen dispensers were installed for the first day of school. Then social media exploded with word they were crack pipes. Selling a glass pipe or pen is not illegal, but installing machines without permit and site plan is a code violation. Preying on children. I've never bought a pen that came with filters that would be used. I've also not seen many glass pens, so we, we're pretty clear what the intent is. Suffolk police and the district attorney are now investigating. And it looks like a pen, and then you can see when you take it apart, now you have what would be the pipe. The screen to separate the drugs and then smoke the other men like that. Law enforcement receiving tips. So far, no one has been linked to the dispensers. A bogus phone number on the back. The machines were cemented in place with concrete. From Coram, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. Anybody with information on who installed the vending machines in Corman Medford is asked to call the police in Suffolk County.